will be bringing his food. Since it's a small bag, I'll probably just bring the whole bag instead of portioning quill bites. And these are the antioxidants one. Don't judge this one because they're fraying really bad. <laughs> Forget the pee pads. Hey guys, welcome back to the French Bull Vlog. My name is Delaney and my French Bulldog's name is Monte Carlo. He's right here looking out the window. He just got a bath. Today's video is going to be all about what to pack for your Frenchie when going on vacation. We are leaving for the beach in a few days and we have family coming in town today. So I wanted to get the packing kind of done with and over with right now before everyone gets here. So I decided that I was going to film it for you guys to show what I pack for Monty for the beach and for vacation. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing is his carrier. We'll probably put him in this for the car ride just so he can sleep and it's not he's not like, you know, jumping all around because if he's not in his carrier, then most likely he's not going to be sleeping. So we're bringing that and then also his backpack is probably what I'm going to put everything in, like pack all his stuff in. So just because I can throw it on and it's multi-use. So we'll be bringing both the carrier and the backpack. I'm sniffing them. He honestly loves these things, um, which I never thought he would. I thought he would hate them because he hates like crates and stuff like that. But he actually loves his backpacks. As you can see, he's so funny. But now I'm gonna grab his food, some treats, and just a couple other things that he's going to need for vacation. So the first thing is his food. I did go over this food in the last video about all about my French Bulldog's diet. So I will be bringing his food. Since it's a small bag, I'll probably just bring the whole bag instead of portioning out each meal and putting it in a separate bag, just because as long, like, just in case we have to feed him a little more or something like that, I don't wanna run out or if I proportion incorrectly, I don't wanna run out or anything. I will also be bringing his daily vitamin. He gets the Zesty Paws Omega-3 Krill Bites, and these are the antioxidants one. Um, we, he's been on these for a few weeks now. <laughs> he loves them, but uh, they're, um, they're honestly good for so many things, um, including allergies and joint, heart, immune, and brain health, just all kinds of things. So we'll be bringing that with us. And then but going over to his little basket, we have right by the door, we keep his basket of all his little goodies. So obviously we'll be bringing his harness. Don't judge this one, it's like fraying really bad because when he um, goes on walks, he likes to rub up against the concrete and the side sidewalk. Um, so that's why that's the way it is. We'll be bringing these because he gets one of these every day. I actually got these from Marshalls and they were on clearance for $10 um, for 43 little dental treats. So he gets one of those. And then his snout lately has been pretty dry. So I'm also gonna bring his little snout smoother just in case we need this at any point. And then obviously I've talked about these before, but his little travel pet wipes. I'm not gonna be bringing like shampoo or anything. So just in case he gets dirty at the beach or muddy or anything like that, we'll have some pet wipes to clean him off with. I think bringing a travel bowl is important. So we have his little collapsible bowl here. Uh, now we'll probably get like I think we're staying at an Airbnb, so we'll probably use one of their bowls there because it is a pet friendly place, but we'll bring those just in case. And since Monty is trained with pee pads, he's not 100% trained outside, we will have to bring pee pads and then show them where we locate them throughout like the place we're staying, just because obviously I don't want him to go, like, go in the bathroom in the house. So I'll probably put out bring maybe two for the day. So I'm just gonna grab like a stack and then maybe a few extras, just in case, you just never know. So we have a whole stack of those that I'm going to add, but yeah. Never forget the pee pads if your dog is pee pad trained. So everything is all packed up. Monty, 
he got a bath, so he doesn't have his little collar on right now. But everything is all packed up. It's all in here. And then I'll just go ahead and shut this and take this with us. And then we also will have his little backpack just in case he needs it for the beach or anything like that. But it looks like somebody is ready to go on vacation, right, Mons? <laughs> so excited, good boy, good boy. Since we are going to the beach, I'll be bringing his life jacket. This is the Outward Hound <laughs> life jacket. He's not so sure about it yet. He honestly has never worn it, so we'll see how this goes. But it's just like, a, I think this is a size small, and it's just a little flotation device. And then as for toys, we'll bring his favorite little Nyla bones, a couple squeaky toys, and then since we are meeting some family there, I'm sure they will have some presents for him and he will be spoiled rotten um, and getting all these new treats and toys. So yeah, I'm going to be vlogging the whole time I'm there so you guys can see his first experience at the beach. It'll be first for you guys and for me since he's never been there. Um, we'll take him all around the little beach town as well so you guys will see that and yeah. I think that's it for this video, but please like and subscribe if you want to see more content and let me know what kind of content you want to see. But until next time, bye guys.